Just seize the moment and just do it. So originally I was a department manager for Petco, working retail. I was there for about eight years and I came across the West Virginia Women Work program on Facebook. I had seen it several times and I just randomly one day decided why not, I need a change and I applied that same evening. I actually am a college dropout. I dropped out about six weeks after starting college out of high school and in that time I did get married and have a child and I was able to apply for this program after all of those life changes and really make a huge difference in my life by being exposed to different opportunities in areas of expertise that would allow for me to have a more significant income to provide for my family. The partnership with Women Work has been ongoing for years now and it's been a really great uh, working relationship as uh, we've been able to work with, uh, with the different groups in the different parts of the state. I provide the OSHA 10-hour construction safety program. The OSHA 10-hour program is a nationally recognized program that helps contractors, helps workers get onto job sites and uh, shows that they've had some basic level of training and that they are safe to be out there working. Uh, my gain would be in uh, friendship, that I have worked with a lot of these uh, women over the years and I have run into them out in the workplace, I've run into them at uh, construction expos and things like that. They come up and they talk to me and they tell me what they're doing, where they've been, jobs that they've gotten and things like that. So. We've really developed a uh, friendship with a lot of them. They all have my phone number and email. I hear back from them once in a while and they send me questions about their job sites and things like that. So we are developing this safety culture with them and they are taking it to their workplaces around the state and country. When I joined the program, I did not know where it would take me. I did not have my eyes set on working in solar and through my experience with the class, I was able to narrow down an idea of what I wanted to pursue. I applied for a job shadowing with Solar Holler to see what it was about. And after the first job shadow that I did with a panel installation crew, I applied that same evening for a position as an installer on one of those panel installation crews with Solar Holler. During the interview, I was actually offered the chance to interview for a project management position because of my previous management experience in retail, paired with the trade experience that I gained from the West Virginia Women Work Program. And a couple weeks later, I was presented an offer and began work with Solar Holler as a project manager. I made this decision to do the West Virginia Women Work program on a whim. I was literally sitting in a hammock at a cookout with no real desire to change anything about my life other than I knew I needed a change and I applied for it and here I am just a couple of years later as the senior project manager for the largest solar installation company of West Virginia and that would have never been possible if I hadn't just stepped outside of my comfort zone and the program itself gave me so much confidence, uh, not only in what I could do, but just in myself as a person. And it gave me so much opportunity to be a better mother and to be able to afford to take my son places and to be able to work from home, for instance, in my particular situation and provide for him, not only financially, but emotionally. And I have had such a great experience growing after taking that chance. So all it takes is that first step. 